Good Saturday morning, my friends. This is Tobe. It's been a while since I've done a video, so I figured I would do a quick one today. The Lord just puts it on my heart sometimes to say things, and I know it's been a while. Uh, I think we've all been battling issues with, uh, of course, the virus that's going around. And, man, there's a, such a battle with that, not only, you know, with your own health, but battle between friends and family that some take it more serious than others. Some don't take it serious at all. And you see the same thing with, you know, our government. It's just, um, it's gotten to be such a mess <clears throat> and it's tough to deal with. But I'm not talking about any of that today or picking one side or another. Uh, I am hoping and praying that uh, all of us stay healthy because we do know people personally that have been greatly affected and even some people that have passed from catching this virus. Uh, but what I'm talking about is something that I've been able to do because I felt better these last few days. I have had a struggle and I'm hoping it's more from a change of medicine for some reason with the manufacturer. But these last few days I've been feeling better and I've actually gotten out in the morning and done some of my favorite things to do is fish. And there's been a couple of days that I went that I tried and the weather was just not great, you know, and things, the conditions just weren't good. To fish to catch fish and I caught none and then I've gone the last two days in the morning for just an hour or two and had great days where I caught a lot of fish in just such brief time both trout and redfish in case you're curious and uh, some really nice sizes for some so it made me think of what like my shirt says here you know with this virus going on and there's such a battle spiritually there's a battle physically there's a battle financially you know there's obviously i don't know of any personally on any family that's not having struggles with uh you know with the issues that are going on whether they're having to stay home be with their kids or whatever the case would be here at our house you know we've got our own issues with school and vicky trying to do some teaching from being at home mckenna here is her graduation year from high school and that's really a difficult situation all these different things that are going on, and yet this, I think, is a perfect time for us to do what God said and be fishermen of men, because it's tough for us, but one thing that helps us get through all this is our faith in the Lord, knowing that, uh, you know, what our eventual future would be is eternity in heaven, uh, because he died on the cross for us. But think about those who don't know of, of any future who do not know their Lord and Savior yet and this is all they have they don't have any future to look forward to after they die and and they're in heaven for eternity so I was just thinking this is a time more than ever we can take advantage of this and reach out to those not only to, to those that we know know the Lord because we all need to be praying we all need to have support and uplift each other uh, but especially reach out to those that do not know who our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ is. Oh my goodness, our God is just the salvation of all things. And we think that this is an opportunity. They may just have their ears open more than ever to want to hear what life is all about. So hope that's something that we can consider. I hope you enjoyed watching this. I uh, love all you guys and look forward to talking to you again. And the best I can, I try to keep up watching things and trying to read what little bit I can read with, with the struggle, you know, with the brain thing uh, on Facebook and stuff. But uh, just hang in there, guys. Let's continue to love our Lord and to reach out to others and be the fishermen of men.